Hey there, Fame Fam. Welcome back to The Fame, your go to source for all the latest buzz from the world of the Bringing Up Bates family. Today, we've got some major updates that you won't want to miss. First up, exciting news from Nathan and Esther Bates as they welcome their precious baby boy, Graham Allen Bates, into the world. We'll be sharing all the sweet details about baby Graham's arrival and how the Bates family is celebrating. Next, a little drama that sparked quite the conversation online. Katie Bates was in the hospital preparing to welcome her baby, but a surprising moment between her sisters Carlin and Whitney has fans talking. Whitney kept her shoes on in the hospital bed. Trust us, you'll want to hear the reactions to this unusual move. Then, we've got a truly heartwarming sighting of Tiffany Bates holding her newborn for the very first time, and the emotional significance behind this beautiful moment has fans in awe. And finally, could there be a rainbow baby on the way for Lydia and Trace Bates? After celebrating their second wedding anniversary, fans are buzzing over some subtle but emotional hints from the couple. We're breaking it all down for you, so hit that subscribe button and ring the bell for all things Bates family. Let's jump right in. We have exciting news from the Bringing Up Bates family. Nathan Bates, the fifth child of Gil and Kelly Bates, and his wife Esther have just welcomed their second baby, expanding their growing family. The couple who tied the knot in October 2021 are already proud parents to their one-year-old daughter, Kenna Joy, and now they are celebrating the arrival of their newborn son, Graham Allen Bates. In today's video, we'll dive into all the sweet details surrounding baby Graham's birth, family reactions, and how the Bates family continues to grow. On Friday, October 4th, Nathan, 30, and Esther, 25, shared the joyous news of their baby boy's arrival via a heartfelt Instagram post just two days later, on October 6th. The couple revealed that their son, Graham Allen Bates, was born healthy, weighing 6 pounds and 15 ounces and measuring 20 and a half inches long. Proud Mama Esther posted a beautiful carousel of photos of the newborn, with one particularly sweet image showing the couple lovingly gazing down at their baby boy, and another where Esther gently kisses him on the forehead. Alongside these heartwarming images, Esther captioned the post, introducing Graham Allen Bates' light blue heart, expressing her joy and gratitude for the safe arrival of their son. She she also gave a special shout out to her sister-in-law, Tiffany, for capturing these precious first moments with their baby. Of course, the rest of the Bates family couldn't hold back their excitement either. Several family members jumped into the comments to congratulate the couple. Carlin Bates wrote, he is perfect, while Whitney Bates chimed in with, he's so perfect, congratulations, love you guys. Josie Balco was also quick to express her excitement, commenting, he's precious, cannot wait to meet him. This joyous occasion comes just a year after Nathan and Esther welcomed their first child, daughter Kenna Joy, in October 2022. Their baby announcement earlier this year in March had already left fans buzzing with excitement. The couple revealed the news in a series of beautiful beachside photos, also taken by Tiffany Bates, where the family of three posed with their daughter and a precious ultrasound photo. Esther and Kenna wore matching pink gingham dresses, and the sweet shots of little Kenna looking down at the ultrasound with her parents by her side were simply adorable. The Bringing Up Bates family is well known to fans after being featured on the TLC show for eight seasons, from 2015 to 2021, where viewers got to know Nathan and the entire Bates clan. As the family continues to grow with more grandchildren, the Bates family tree is certainly thriving. Nathan and Esther's journey as a couple has been an exciting one to follow. They announced their engagement in 2021 and married in a beautiful October ceremony that same year. Since then, their family life has flourished, with the arrival of Kenna Joy last fall and now the addition of baby Graham. Fans can't wait to see more glimpses of their life as a family of four. And with such a close-knit extended family, there's sure to be no shortage of love and support. It's clear that baby Graham has already captured the hearts of the Bates family and their fans. As Nathan and Esther embark on this next chapter of parenthood, we can only imagine the adorable moments to come. What are your thoughts on this sweet new addition to the Bates family? Next, we're diving into a rather bizarre and eyebrow-raising moment from the Bates family. As Katie Bates was preparing to welcome her baby, her sisters Carlin and Whitney were by her side in the hospital room. Sounds pretty typical, right? Well, not exactly. Carlin, being mindful, took off her shoes before getting comfy on Katie's bed, but Whitney, 
not so much. She kept her shoes on, sparking a wave of concern and disgust among fans. Let's talk about why this seemingly small detail has caused such a stir online. Now, most of us know how hospitals are. Sterile environments where hygiene is critical, especially for new moms and their babies. Fans were quick to notice that Whitney Bates had her shoes on while lounging on Katie's hospital bed. It wasn't just any bed. This is the same space Katie was going to bring her newborn into. Carlin, on the other hand, did take her shoes off, showing at least some awareness of cleanliness, but for Whitney it seemed like no shoes on the bed was not a priority. This raised a lot of red flags for viewers. Many commented on how unsanitary this was, with some saying that shoes, which have walked through who knows what, don't belong anywhere near a hospital bed. Some fans pointed out that Katie herself mentioned in the past how she's cautious about germs, wearing slippers around the room and socks in bed. So, why didn't she say anything to Whitney? Could it be that Katie was too shy to speak up? or perhaps didn't want to cause any tension in the moment. And it doesn't stop there. Fans have also noted that this casual disregard for cleanliness isn't exactly new for the Bates family. Remember the time Josie Bates had donuts on her front door welcome mat for her kids? Yeah, the same mat that's walked on daily by delivery people and whoever else stops by. To some viewers, these examples show that as long as the Bates' Instagram posts and photos look perfect, the cleanliness of the situation seems to take a back seat. On social media, the reactions came pouring in. One person said, I'd be grossed out especially in a hospital where germs are everywhere. Another pointed out how shoes on a hospital bed were not only inconsiderate but also a health concern. A few even said they would have snapped if someone had done that in their hospital room. Others found it hard to believe that no one in the family thought this was a big deal, calling the behavior gross and unhygienic. It's clear that this seemingly small moment has left a big impression on fans, many of whom are questioning the Bates' hygiene practices. Whitney's shoes on the bed move may seem like a minor slip-up to some, but for others, it speaks volumes about the family's approach to cleanliness and personal boundaries. What do you think? Was this just an innocent mistake, or does it show a bigger pattern within the family? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Next, we've got a heartwarming update from the Bates family, and this one is truly special. Tiffany Bates has been spotted looking absolutely radiant as she holds her newborn baby for what seems like the first time. For Tiffany, this moment carries so much emotional weight, and fans couldn't help but notice how happy she looks while embracing her little one. In this video, we'll dive into why this photo is so significant and why it has fans buzzing. Tiffany Bates, Lawson Bates' wife, recently shared a sweet and emotional photo of herself holding her baby boy William. For many, this may seem like just another adorable baby picture, but for Tiffany, it's a much deeper and more meaningful moment. As someone who was adopted at birth by a white Californian couple, Tiffany grew up without ever sharing physical traits with anyone in her family. This baby is the very first person she has met who shares her genes, a powerful, life-changing experience for her. Fans quickly pointed out how happy and natural Tiffany looks holding her baby. One fan commented, she holds the baby so much better than Lawson, and others reminisced about their own squishy baby days, a term lovingly used to describe the newborn phase. It's not just about holding the baby, though. It's about the deep connection Tiffany is likely feeling as she finally holds someone who looks like her, someone who shares her DNA. One viewer noted, this is literally the first pic I've seen of her and the baby. All the others have just been Lawson and William and that's what makes this photo so special. While Lawson often takes center stage when it comes to their baby, it's clear that Tiffany is soaking in every second of this precious moment. As someone commented, I hope she enjoys every second of this special time. Tiffany might be enjoying the fact that Lawson is currently out of town, helping with hurricane relief efforts. Some fans joked that this might be one of the rare times Tiffany gets to hold the baby without Lawson around, calling him a baby hog. One fan even mentioned that seeing Tiffany with her baby while while Lawson is away, is a rare sight, saying, enjoy this time, Tiffany. This moment isn't just sweet. It's also a testament to Tiffany's journey as an adopted woman. She has faced unique challenges, including likely navigating microaggressions and possibly outright racism. Some fans even expressed concerns about how welcoming the Bates family truly is toward her. Given their past associations and the family's more conservative beliefs, despite that, Tiffany has made meaningful connections, especially with Aaron and Esther Bates, and seems determined to carve out her own space within the family. But let's not forget the real star here, Baby William. Fans are calling him the cutest baby in the entire
entire family, and honestly, it's hard to argue with that. Tiffany's joy and pride are written all over her face, and it's clear that this little one is truly a blessing to her and Lawson. So, what do you think of this heartwarming moment? It's clear that Tiffany is soaking in the love and joy of motherhood, and we can't wait to see more of her bonding with baby William. If you enjoyed this update, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more news on the Bates family and beyond. Leave a comment below with your thoughts on Tiffany's journey as a new mom and how this sweet photo touched your heart. Finally, we're diving into a topic that's tugging at the hearts of fans everywhere. After celebrating their second wedding anniversary, it seems that bringing up Bates stars Lydia and Trace Bates may be hinting at something exciting on the horizon. A rainbow baby, with the couple's history of loss and resilience, fans are buzzing with speculations about a potential pregnancy announcement. Let's get into all the details, from the anniversary messages to the touching hints they may have dropped. Trace Bates took to Instagram to share a heartwarming message dedicated to his wife Lydia as they marked their two-year wedding anniversary. In his post, Trace expressed how much he cherishes his life with Lydia, saying he still can't believe she's his wife. He added, Love you more than words can describe. Happy second anniversary, Lydia Bates. Fans of the couple were moved by his sweet words and their strong bond, especially after such a tough year. Lydia, not to be outdone, added her own unique twist to the celebration. She decided to surprise Trace by slipping into her wedding dress once again, creating a memorable moment for her husband and their son Riker. The couple's fans were equally captivated by Riker's adorable reaction to seeing his mom in the stunning gown, a touching moment that reflects the family's joy despite past hardships. But it was an Instagram post from Lydia that sent fans into a frenzy. The couple shared a clip from their beach trip, where they were seen taking photos to commemorate their anniversary. In the video, the two posed together with Trace gently placing his hands on Lydia's tummy, a gesture that immediately sparked fan speculation. That's an announcement photo sneak, one fan commented, while another added, this has to have another announcement behind it. As in a baby announcement, could this be a subtle hint that the Bates family might be preparing for the arrival of a rainbow baby? The couple has been open about their grief after suffering a miscarriage earlier this year, but they have remained steadfast in their faith, hoping to grow their family again. Fans are eager to see if Lydia and Trace's recent post hints at this long-awaited news. The Bates family has certainly been through a lot, including Lydia's diagnosis of aquagenic pruritus, a rare condition that causes her to experience sunburn-like symptoms when her skin comes into contact with water or even sweat. Despite these challenges, Lydia continues to push forward, balancing her family life and her career as a photographer. Their recent trip to Hawaii, which Lydia documented on her Instagram stories, was another moment of joy for the couple. From their beach adventures to exploring Honolulu, it's clear that Lydia and Trace are making the most of their time together and creating cherished memories with Riker. As fans of the Bringing Up Bates family, we're all keeping our fingers crossed that Lydia and Trace might soon share more exciting news about their growing family. Whether this latest Instagram post is a subtle baby announcement or simply a sweet anniversary celebration, we're sending them all the love and support as they navigate their journey together. Be sure to stay tuned to the fame for more updates on the Bates family, and don't forget to leave your thoughts on this potential baby news in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.